After reviewing all the case law that offers precedent, Jensen versus Superior Court being the most relevant, I've reluctantly decided that Mr. Fleck does have the right as an attorney to dress himself how he likes as long as he doesn't cause disorder or interfere with the functioning of the court. I will not allow this proceeding to become as unruly as it is outside, and I will not let you turn this into any more of a circus than you already have. Mr. Dent, call your next witness. The state calls Gary Puddles. Bailiff, you please escort Mr. Puddles to the stand. Please raise your right hand. Do you solemnly swear that the testimony you're about to give is the whole truth and nothing but the truth? So help you God. I do. Good morning, Mr. Puddles. Thank you for being here. So one last question, sir. The person who you saw stab Randall Kleimanhofer to death are they in this courtroom here today? Yes. Can you point them out to all of us and describe his clothing? He's, he's sitting right there at the table, wearing a red suit and clown makeup. May the record reflect the identification of the accused, Your Honor? Yes, it will. Nothing further, Your Honor. <laughs> 